Say it. Huh? Yeah. So, Hello guys, today, as I promised long time ago, we are finally going to make some pho. So, uh, it's a Vietnamese dish, and that's why I have my Vietnamese husband with me. Because he's going to teach me how to make this dish. I have never done it before by myself. And we are going to balance a little bit uh, between, you know, the original recipe when you have to use specific ingredients we maybe will switch some ingredients or just make it simple and accessible for everyone to try to make this dish first of all we of course gonna talk about ingredients what do we need to make this dish of course there are two ingredients that you 100% need is actually noodles and actually soak the noodles beforehand uh, while you cut in the ingredients to make them cook faster and the second ingredient that you definitely need oxtails oxtails they do look, look like this we actually have those asian meatballs why do i stress that it is asian meatballs because it is that they're much denser than you know the homemade uh, meatballs that you will make of course you can replace uh, maybe if you will put more flour to try to make a homemade they will be much denser but these mm -hmm. ones are definitely like chewy and dense mm -hmm. so they are perfect for fall and we also decided to experiment a little bit and uh, marinate it beef yeah it's beef and we marinate it with uh, vinegar, vinegar honey and uh, put in some uh, soy sauce and fish sauce so use the the cow so uh enough with the meat let's talk about the other ingredients so we have asian coriander one ingredient which is uh lime bean sprouts also sweet sweet basil also use parsley it's uh, called european grass the onions and uh, ginger because we're going to fry them a little bit nope. we are cutting first nope. you don't need to be too clear and uh, clean on the out wash it and uh, make sure it's clean and then cut so uh, we don't need to cut too much yeah it comes all right so what do we do with these vegetables So all these ingredients are possible to find in the Asian stores as we, we can just pluck it out. Pluck it out. But do we pluck it out now or we can pluck it out later. And it is time to uh, cut the meat. And uh, here is the also a trick about this meat how to cut it. No, because it's uh, not see mm -hmm. this. The piece like this? Yeah. No. Like in the takeaways here. Uh, it's like so. The, something that we also need to remember, but it's also optional, is a uh, star anise. Anise. Yeah. Smell it's it. Yeah. Star. <laughs> uh, one onion. Gingers. And ginger. We can do this. We are also putting the halves of the spring onions for the taste. Anise to the foot. Mm. All the power. Yeah, so three pieces of this. Yeah. Not pronounce it today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And yeah, so it's much tender. I just use this, it will. Water is like this. Really? Well, it is meat. Yeah, so what we did is remove the scum as much as we can. So as you can see, it's still there. And to actually remove it we just wash the meat and we do we remove the bros yeah yeah it's and we basically thing. just not use this bros in those charred uh, onions and ginger and uh, spring onions and yeah half an hour i'm gonna put in some fish sauce meat and we are also putting it in 
in the broth. So originally we haven't really add any oil. This is the oil from the meat. There, let's cook the noodles. So we do not really turn off the stove, we just reduce it. Mm -hmm. And uh, we are going to cook the noodles in the separate one. Yeah. What we can do though, is to take out those chunks of meat. Too much? It's fine. For you. Just layer it on the. I don't know what this is called. Separate. You want it pink or not? No. Just make sure to separate them. Three. Our four is ready and we filled our plates with uh, noodles and meat. There are meatballs, the meat that have been cooking last and also we have the whole thing with uh, uh, meat like this. And now we are waiting to fill uh, those plates with the soup. Yeah. Yeah. Here is the plate. Just hungry. Yeah, and then we have all the greeneries. We can just put it straight. It's okay yeah. to put like this. Yeah. Juan is going to show you uh, how to eat. So what we do is deep uh, meat, which were cooked here in the soup, in the sauce, and eat like this. And then the rest you just eat however you want. Thank you very much for watching and I hope you enjoy and try to Smart. make your four at home. Yes. Hope to see you again. Bye bye. Yes. Why are you eating my meat though? There. <laughs> oh, it's so hello guys. Today as I saw so the meat, you know, turns sides, I guess, and